Hey, happy Friday. Can I say happy new year too? I mean, here we are, 2024, and it is upon us. So a couple things, when the new year starts, we have a brand new season for community groups. And we want every person who belongs to this church, we want you in a community group because that is where our sense of belonging and real spiritual growth takes place. So if you're not in a group, email josh at churchonthehill.com because there's a group for every age and every stage of life and every night of the week. Also, if you are in a group and you feel like, yeah, I really belong here, hey, would you reach out to the people that you know and invite them to your group because everybody needs a place to belong. So that's our new season. We're starting this Sunday. I hope you'll be part of a group. But listen, there's a smaller group of you that maybe a community group isn't the right group for you this season. Maybe the right group is this. It's divorce care. And it's a divorce care recovery group. That is one of the most painful seasons in a person's life when they're going through divorce or considering divorce. We want to walk with you in that journey and we want to support you. There's a whole season coming up, 13 weeks, and one of our own volunteers who's been through this themselves, they're going to lead this. And we would love for you, if that's the season of your life, let us walk with you in this. Don't do that journey alone. You'll find some details below on how to sign up for that. Next item, Japan. Have you ever wanted to go there? We actually have a global partner in Japan, but did you know this about Japan? They have one of the least percentages of Christians of any country. Half of 1% of people in Japan are evangelical Christians. Because of that, we wanna really support John Houlette, our global partner there. This summer, we're gonna send a team to Japan to be involved in a basketball camp for kids, as well as a cafe ministry with kids and also senior adults. If that sounds interesting to you, January 14th, which is a Sunday, and January 21st, right Right after our services in the prayer room is an information meeting. If you're just curious, go check that out. There's also an email below if you wanna email some questions in as well. I hope that you will join us in that team this summer. Final thing is this, let me say thank you for those of you who gave generously last year. Uh, through our, our giving, you giving, and as well as other revenue streams from our church, we were able to meet budget for 2023. And so I just wanna say thank you. But that also means that we're changing something this year. If you noticed last fall, we changed the platform that we used when we asked you to download a new app for church. It's the Planning Center app. Well, the beginning of the year, we're changing our financial platform to that Planning Center app and Planning Center Online, which means this. If you give periodically to the church, you, you don't need to change anything. You can go online and give or come in person and give, and you might not even notice that anything is different. However, for those of you that you give an automatic recurring gift, either from your bank or your, your credit card, and that just, it's set up automatically, you will need to make some changes. Um, below in the information in this e-news, you'll see how to cancel that old account and also how to start a new automatic recurring. So we just wanna make you aware of that. And if you have questions, make sure that you email Matt Rickley or Matt at churchonthehill.com. And you might not have heard that name in a while. And you're like, wasn't he our old worship pastor? The answer is yes. And he's still on staff with us. He manages all of our financial office. And so he's still a part of our staff. You'll see his face on our website as well. Uh, he will have you, he will have help and resources for you about how to go through those steps if you need help with that. Again, happy new year. And we'll see you on Sunday as we worship together. God bless.